we doing everybody? Welcome back to Dagwood's East Tonsorium. I'm Dagwood Z with the Shaven Cadre. Merry Christmas to everybody. And today we're gonna to be using Sterling Christmas Eve, of course. This is my favorite Christmas scent out of all the Christmas scents and holiday scents that I've tried. Uh, this, hands down, is my favorite. Um, it's a very coniferous type scent, so it gives you the feeling of a Christmas tree uh, in, your, in your house. Uh, but it also incorporates uh, some cooking flavors as well. Uh, it is most definitely not in the gourmand side of the house, uh, but this gives you a really, really nice holiday sensation. Really puts you in the mood um, and something I really enjoy. Um, this is in Sterling Tallow Base. Here's the uh, ingredient list right here. Uh, just a wonderful base. This is my baseline soap. Um, I wouldn't make my baseline soap if it wasn't a phenomenal soap base. Um, so this is what everything is measured up against. If it performs better than it, um, then you know it, 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 that's when you start reaching up into your elite level soaps. Uh, and you know you do have some grades in between the elites and, and, and sterling. Um, on the uh, tier scale, I would put it at a tier one, uh, box three. Uh, as a general rule, some scents like this one, I would put it a box two. Uh, some scents, tier one, box four. Um, and then others, maybe a tier one or tier two, box five, if the scent is that bad. Uh, but I'm only thinking, I think I've only encountered maybe two, maybe three scents from Sterling that I just really didn't agree with. Uh, we're going to be using my Paladin Jade Cleo today. This is a 26 millimeter. And for the razor, we're going to be using the Jerry Stark. This is a 7 8 with a slight smile. Uh, it's full hollow ground uh, with a slight belly. With a French point. So without further ado, let's get right over here and get to lathering. This is going to be a shorter video today. Um, you're going to get one pass and then uh, that's about it. Just got off work, actually had a longer day at work. So, um, gonna get up and uh, get up a little early and make sure that, take care of a few things before I go into work the next day. I used to have a hard time lathering strolling. I would get good lathers, but it would just take me a while to develop the lathers. Um, as I've gone through, I've figured out a good way to do it. Um, it's best to go in with a a damp brush, but not soaking wet, and load the brush. Let the brush load, nice and deep. Uh, Thirty second load for me now is good. It used to be around forty five seconds to a minute, <coughs> but I've gotten it to where that uh, it's not so much of an issue anymore. Um, I do bloom this soap. Uh, it aids in the loading process. If you don't bloom the soap, you, you might need to, to load for a little bit longer. I hope everybody's holiday season has, has gone well so far. Been somewhat hectic out here. Just air and water incorporated. Fling and ladder. Got to love it when you fling ladder. It's like an egg beater. It's not the thirstiest of soaps. Um, it can definitely handle water, uh, but it does have a breaking point. And just something to be cognizant of. But the one, the best thing about Sterling 
by far. I mean, it's a phenomenal performing soap, phenomenally performing soap. Rod and, Rod and Mandy did just do a great job. Um, is they are, in my opinion, by far the best value to performance that you get out of any soap maker. Um, just absolutely top-notch stuff all the way around. So that's good for the lather. Might do a little additional building on the face. Um, but yeah, so see you in a second, guys. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and do my hot towel. Uh, no shower today. Uh, I'm going to shower before, before I go into work. But a uh, hot towel should take care of my prep. And uh, yeah, see you in a second, guys. All right, guys. So strength of sun on Christmas Eve is about a three out of five. Just typical, they tend to be on the, uh, Sterling tends to be on the stronger side of the house. Which, for me, I love this scent, so um, lathered up, it actually builds a little bit, maybe a three and a half. And this really is one of my favorite Sterling scents. Rod and Mandy really did a good job with this. It's got a decent sheen to it. Should be a good first pass. Got two days of growth. Have not shaved since the last uh, video. such a big blade this really does handle like a smaller razor um, it gets it can get you into trouble though um, because it's easy to forget how much inertia this blade is carrying um, Unbelievable to me that we're at the end of 2018 already. It's been a whirlwind year for certain. my blade off in between that. 
passes. Um, plus, since I use my uh, my water basin or my water bowl, it has hot water. It keeps the blade a little bit warmer. So, which increases the comfort level of the shave. So, all right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and do my last two passes, and we'll be right back. All right, guys, had a really nice shave. Starting Christmas Eve, did catch myself right there. Uh, just a little nick. Uh, I think I just went over a pimple. Um, not too bad. Um, honestly, the razor needs to go to the stones. This will be the first time it's gone to the stones since I've got it. It's got probably about 25, 30 shaves on it. Um, I could probably push it longer, but just take it to the stones, do some maintenance honing. Um, but yeah, just awesome. Topped off with the uh, matching aftershave balm. Uh, if you haven't tried Sterling's balms, they're actually very, very good. Uh, don't leave your skin feeling oily at all. Um, skin's feeling nice and moisturized. Uh, and we also use the Paladin Jade Cleo brush. Uh, this is a very dense brush. Um, wonderfully soft tips. Just a great brush overall. My first Paladin too. Um, yeah. So that's the shave today, guys. Really enjoyable. Like I said, it's gonna be a short video today, uh, but I did want to do a video. Wish everybody a very, very merry uh, Christmas, happy holidays. Um, you will see me again before the new year. And uh, yeah, if you haven't checked out the shaving cadre, oh, God. If you're interested in Sterling's Christmas Eve or any of the, their other scents, check them out at sterlingsoap.com, S-T-I-R, L I N G, uh, sterlingsoap.com. And uh, you can also find them at online reseller, retailers, Maggard Razors, West Coast Shaving, Groomatorium, Italian Barber. Uh, they all carry Sterling. Uh, they're widely available. So check them out, guys. Uh, you won't be sorry. Best value on the market for shaving equipment or for shaving soap and aftershaves, in my opinion. Uh, and shaving brushes too. Their shaving brushes are outstanding. Um, but all the same, have a wonderful Christmas. Very Merry Christmas. Um, I appreciate every single one of you that are watching the videos and taking time out of your day and spending it with me. And uh, check us out at the Shaving Cadre. Stop on by, say hello, and introduce yourself and join in the conversations. All right, see you there, www.theshavingcadre.com. Until next time, guys, I'm Dagwood Z. Peace. Oh, 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 oh,